today is Saturday, 12 March. Your mission and ministry. The theme verse for today is taken from the from the book of Mark, chapter 16, verse 20, from the Messenger Translation. And the disciples went everywhere, preaching the master working right with them, validating the message with indisputable evidence. Pastor is saying to us, Jesus knew he had a mission and a ministry in the earth. He was to establish the kingdom of God in the earth with principles to live by. God's way of doing things, a new language and a new mentality. Today, we are a nation, a kingdom of priests with a mission and ministry in the earth. Thanks be unto God. We heeded the call when he said, As my father have sent me, even so send I you. John 20 verse 21. We are fulfilling his mandates, the continuation of the ministry of Jesus to set up a kingdom not made by hands. The kingdom of heaven in the earth. To have a better grasp and understanding of this truth, let us take a look at how Luke, who wrote the Gospel of Luke and the Book of Acts, concluded. And he and he led them out as far as to Bethany, and he lifted up his hands and blessed them. And it came to pass, while he blessed them, he was parted from them and carried up into heaven. And they worshipped him and returned to Jerusalem with great joy and were continually in the temple, praising and blessing God. Amen. Luke chapter 24, verses 50 through 53. How touching this is mark in his account first reiterated what luke said so then after the lord had spoken unto them he was received up into heaven and sat on the right hand of god mark 16 verses 19 in addition he recounted what the apostle did next in the 20th verse and they went forth and preached everywhere, the Lord working with them and confirming the word with signs following. Amen. Mark chapter 16 verse 20. They went, they went forth and preached everywhere, the Lord working with them and confirming the word with signs following. Amen. They went and preached everywhere. That is what we are doing today as well. Don't be left out. Preach the gospel with passion. Recall what the Lord charged us to do. Heal the sick. Cleanse the lepers. Raise the dead. Cast out devils. Freely you have received freely you give matthew chapter 10 verse 8 he has given us both the power and authority to do mighty works in his name and demonstrate the character of the spirit to our world therefore take your place in the ministry of the gospel never lose focus of the master's calling on your life this is your mission and ministry in the earth. Serve him selflessly with undying passion. Prayer. Dear Father, I thank you for the furtherance of the glorious gospel of Christ through us today. I remain passionate about preaching the gospel, knowing that the Lord himself is working with me. 
in and, and through me. I'm committed to the spread of the gospel around the world as many are brought out of sin into righteousness and into the glorious liberty of the sons of God. In Jesus' name, amen. For further reading, please read Matthew chapter 28, verses 18 through 20. 1 Corinthians chapter 9, verses 16 through 17. And for your one-year Bible reading plan, please read Mark chapter 15, verses 1 through 20. And Numbers chapter 32 through chapter 33. And for your two-year Bible reading plan, please read Acts chapter 27, verses 1 through 8. And Psalms chapter 73. Rhapsody of realities. Worth hearing.